how to add effects to photos in CapCut. So once you have your photos in your timeline, it's actually really easy and very similar to what you would do uh, with a regular video clip such as this one. But what you'll do is you'll have this in your timeline. Um, you can get it positioned any way you want. So we have her right in the middle. And then the left-hand side of your screen on the dashboard, we're gonna go to uh, effects right here. And we're gonna treat this just like we would a regular video clip uh, within CapCut. Once I click effects, uh, there's a drop-down menu for video effects. I click it there I can scroll uh, through and see all the different video flex video effects you can do there's also another one for body effects at the bottom once you do that and so now you have body effects that you can do body effects will just affect the the body of the the person who's the subject in the shot or in the video clip and so I'll just scroll through the trending here to show you what I got um, but you can see some of these have the pro option at the top so if you have pro you can use them but if I click on them um, you can kind of see an example of them right there. Um, and so that's kind of like your sample of what you can do. Uh, and so what I'll do here is I'll scroll down and find one that's actually free. So once you have the effect that you want, um, you just take it and you drag it over to the top of your clip there and you add the effect in. And then you can kind of see how it flows into the into the project there so what i can do i'm going to do this let's rescale this back there's the effect right there it kind of has that like nice little electric glow to it and flows right through and then i can just edit uh the clip to match just like that boom and now when it plays you have your electric clip now that is how you add effects to photos within CapCut. Um, and you can also like, you know, adjust the speed, the twist, the range. You can even adjust the color. Let's see if I can get a color, different color going in here. So there you got the color right there. And so you can kind of see once I pull through here, I can adjust the color and make it different colors like so. You can adjust the range to it to where how much, how see how it like adjusts the glow. I can make it fully go in there. And you can even adjust the size. That's pretty good right there. And then the speed. You can adjust the speed. And just slow it down a bit. So now when you play it, a little bit more there. That's pretty good. We can do the same thing over here on this guy. We'll add the electrifying effect here. So there's your original right there. But what I can do is I can grab it and I can change the color of it. Just like a, kind of like an orange there. And then uh, just, once again, same thing. Affect the range, affect the size, and we can slow it down. And then what I can do here is in the photo, I'll zoom in just a bit. And see how it's tracking when I edit the photo? It's actually tracking with it. So now, when we play the photo, let's see how it goes. And electric all the way through. And that's pretty cool. So that's how you add effects to photos in CapCut. It's very, very easy to do. Um, I also have another video that shows you how to work with keyframes in photos. And so if you uh, watch that video, we'll put a link in the description below. Um, that'll show you actually how to get the photos to move. So when you do both at one time, like you add movement to the photo on top of the on top of the um, effect, it's actually pretty cool and adds a lot of like dynamic uh, uh, like movement to it, which will keep the audience engaged. So hopefully that helps you guys out. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section below, uh, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please take the time to like, comment, and subscribe as it helps us to further please our YouTube overlords. Check out more links in the description for continued assistance on your CapCut projects. And please keep your arms and legs inside the craft until it comes to a complete stop. Be sure to mind your headspace and watch your step as you exit. Failure to comply may result in serious injury or death. We will see you next time Comet Creators. End transmission.